Hey guys, welcome to Tech Expands. In this video, we're talking about the 2021 iPad Pro. That's right, the 2021 iPad Pro. Uh, this video is um, very requested on my website and people have made me a lot of times for this video. So, uh, I made this video specially for you guys. So, please like, share and subscribe. So, without any further ado, let's get started. So, the iPad Pro 2021, uh, the rumors say that it will have a mini LED display. So that's, that means that there will be more, a more color vibrant display and that allows the iPad Pro to be thinner. So that's a plus. Well, uh, talking about thinness, uh, it will be thinner because of the mini LED display and that is better display quality uh well how thin the ipad pro is doesn't matter to you if you still got the heavy magic keyboard so they'll probably make a new magic keyboard too but <laughs> even if you use it along the magic keyboard it doesn't matter to you if you're, you're gonna use it on just one table but it does matter to you if you're the guy that puts the ipad pro in the bag and does his or her work on the way. So then it matters to you. Secondly, approve improved speakers. That's that's obvious. Well, uh, actually, so the 2020 iPad Pro has about 6 GB RAM. We will be expecting to see some more RAM. And talking about hardware, there will be the A14X Bionic chip in it. And it will run the same iOS 14. In fact, there might be iOS 14 updates uh, to older devices as well, uh, beta updates, maybe like the iPhone for the iPhone 11 and, and the iPad Air, the not the not the fourth generation iPad Air, of course, the second, if that supports iOS 14. So so that's a plus. So well, what do we get? Uh, updated RAM, updated display, thinner. Uh, so that decreases the weight but a thinner display might uh, a thinner iPad might lead to uh, a, a, a go down in the durability so that's that might be bad so that's that and then we get improved speakers so that's all we get and the design will be the same I would love to see a new design because I'm kind of bored because there's this, that, there's that same design from 2018, except there's just more cameras in the 2020 version. So I would just love to see a new design because that just got boring. I mean, I know that we have seen the home button design from, for about six years, I think. And then Apple updated their design only to the iPad Pro, the bezel-less display. But I'm already bored of it and I would love a newer design. So thumbs up for that. And but still the design of the 2020 iPad Pro is bezel-less, which is good. And I love that design. No complaints there. But still would love to see a newer design. So uh, that's it for watching. There isn't much information about the iPad Pro 2021 version. So yeah, that's 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 really it. And because you guys requested this video, uh, please like, share, and subscribe. I love to make videos for you guys, so please don't forget to subscribe. Because uh, I need subscribers. So if you subscribe, just write down in the comments that you have subscribed. I will give you a shout out. And my subscribers have gone from fifteen to nineteen subscribers. So uh, whoever uh, those uh, subscribers are who have subscribed. Please comment on this video that you have subscribed so I can give you a shout out. And that's it for this video. Thank you. And also before you go, we are also expected to see the AirPods. Uh, AirPods 3rd gen coming out in the same launch event of the iPad Pro. So that's, that's really it. I promise this is it. That's really it. Okay, thanks for watching. Please like, subscribe.